So, my eyes are already primed and I did already put my Tatcha Silk Canvas down on my face. Today for my eyes, I want to go in with my 3502 palette. Very warm shades, very fall colors. Yes. Especially this shade right here. I believe it's called Fire? Yeah, Fire. Really want to use this one today. How I'm going to use it, I'm not sure yet. So, like my banner says on the page, we're just going to wing it today. So I think what I want to do is go in with, ugh, not a super neutral brown, but kind of more of a warmer shade. I think I'm going to go with these two right here. These two browns right here, starting with this one and then going in with this one. And those two are universal and orb. So I'm going to take my Morphe M441 brush and go in with universal first. Blending that out really well, making sure it's evenly placed all over the crease area. Okay, so now, let me see, I am going to take Orb and warm up the crease area a little bit. We're trying to get that really good blend, guys. Alright, now I think I'm going to... I'm going to go in with my M443 brush and take Fire, that really bright red, and pop this over those two transition shades. Ooh. I'm just going to go back in with my M441 and blend this all together and go back and forth with that just because this is like a neon red almost. I love it. Bring the tails out a little bit. All right, so that's that shade. All right, so next shade we're gonna go in with is, we're gonna take this shade right here, which is rich, no, brick. And, mm, mm, mm. no, we're not gonna go in with that shade. I don't wanna do that shade. I wanna do, I think I'm actually gonna go in with rich, the shade right here, rich, brave, and in the zone, these three browns. So I'm going to take Brave first, and I'm going to take it on my E9 from ColourPop. We're going to focus this on the outer corner, and then take my M433 and use that to blend them into each other. And then I'm going to take In The Zone, that other brown shade, and just add it on top. We're just going to pretty much use this to add some depth as well as like a gradient shade onto the lid. And then, and then, and then, and then, we'll go in with Rich. The deepest shade, and I'm gonna focus this mostly on the outer V. And just taking a little bit more of fire and helping that to blend it out, as well as make sure we don't lose it in the shadows. So I'm gonna do the same thing on the other eye. And I am bringing this kind of far over in the upper crease, but keeping it super, limited to the like very middle of my crease. I'm not trying to go up with this. And I only bring it over when there's less product on my brush. Whew. Okay, so that's done. I'm gonna cut my crease now. Okay, so that is my cut crease. All right, so first I think I'm gonna go in with Pure, the champagne and gold color right here. And I'm going to take that on my R42 brush. Don't think I need Fix Plus for the shadow yet, but we'll see. I'm gonna pack it on with my finger rather than just this brush. Okay, so that gold shade is laid down. I am going to blend out these edges. I think I'm gonna take in the zone first. I'm actually gonna take another shimmer. This one is Zippy. This one right here. Zippy. I'm gonna pack this. Going this way. This is like a really pretty coppery brown shade. I really, really like it. All right, so now for the other eye. I really like that. That's really pretty. All right, I'm gonna plant my under eye, put some liner on. So I'm gonna actually go on and do my face makeup. You guys don't need to see it. So I will show you guys the finished look in just a minute. Alright guys, so this completes this look. I did pop on the Ace Butte Clotho, Clotho lashes. My lips, I have on my usual three things, a nude lip and then my two lip pencils that I always like to use, which are NYX Lip Pencil in Mahogany and the MAC Lip Pencil in Spice. The lip that I am wearing today is 
Max um, Retro Matte Liquid Lip Color in Burnt Spice. I'll show one of my favorite nudes. Um, and all my face details, all this down below. Yeah, I hope you guys really like this tutorial. I am really happy with how this look turned out, especially since I winged it today. Hang. Hey. If you guys did like this, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And if you like videos like this, go ahead and hit the subscribe button, which is literally right next to the like button. So, anyway, I have to go eat something before I have to go to work. Thank you guys again so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.